So today on my way to work, I was listening to something called American Family Radio. It's by the American Family Association, which is a right-wing organization. They had a guy on called Bishop E.W. Jackson. He's a perennial candidate, or at least he used to be, in Virginia, who was going into a bunch of transphobic crap. So I thought I would attempt to call and see if I got through. And amazingly, the call screener actually got me through. So here is the clip. Let's go to Ari in Ohio. Ari, welcome. Hello. Thank you, Bishop. First time caller. Welcome to the program. Thanks. Um, just kind of wanted to mention, you know, I know all across the country we're seeing things um, like the SAFE Act. Uh, I know here in Ohio it's been introduced by Gary Click. And, you know, growing up in the South, you know, part of the thing that was instilled in me both as you know, a value of America and a value of Christianity itself was respect for each other. And when we have programs like this that constantly demonize trans people, we don't see respect there. I think it's shameful the way that we've done with trying to make trans people the target so that we can get out of the fact that Republicans have no solutions for problems. Thank you, Bishop. Uh, well, Ari, thank you for the call. But look, <laughs> so here, here's the thing about that, folks. Christians didn't start the controversy over trans anything. We've been believing the way we've been believing for 2,000 years. And then along comes somebody says, well, guess what? Your child's not a boy. Your child's not a girl. Uh, that's just a, an assignment by a stupid doctor who's and, and telling children, all he could do was guess. I mean, yeah, Ari, the controversy is on the gender-confused people, the sexually perverse people, the sexually immoral people, the godless people, the anti-Christian people who want to fight to transform the society to reflect their own amorality and their own godlessness and their own anti-Christian bigotry. And so, yeah, are we standing up against it? You better believe it and not apologizing for it. Thank you for the call. Let's go to Sid.